Next up is an innovative solution to fight a growing problem. Hello Sharks, my name is Bianca Wittenberg. I am from El Dorado Hills, California, and I am the co-founder of Firefighter One. Today, I am seeking $150,000 for 15% equity of my company. How many of you know somebody who's lost property due to fire, been evacuated, or had a fire scare themselves? Increasing temperatures and drought are limiting resources, and devastating wildfires are taking over many parts of our country. As a homeowner, you don't have many options. If there's a fire, you could evacuate and hope that the fire department has enough resources to help protect your property, or you could grab a garden hose and spray your roof and perimeter, hoping for the best. That's what my dad would see people doing while watching news coverage of the wildfires every single year. He knew there had to be a better way. So many of those homes, just like ours, had pools. It got him thinking, what about fast access to pool water? And Firefighter One was born. Firefighter One is the first affordable resource designed for pool owners to quickly access the average 25,000 gallons of pool water in seconds. If there ever is a fire, you grab your Firefighter One hose from its third location, connect our adapter to your pool pump, just like that, grab the nozzle, be ready, turn the pump on, aim, and in less than 30 seconds, spray valuable pool water a distance of 40 feet at a rate of 80 gallons per minute. That's pretty cool. This is a 35 foot roof line. In about seven minutes, you could drench the entire property. Wow. So sharks, together we could keep property safer from fire and I could continue building the Firefighter One legacy for my dad. That's very cool. What happens if you've been if you've been instructed to evacuate? If you've been instructed to evacuate, you evacuate. But a lot of times a fire is a couple miles in the distance and embers fly over a mile, so the fires jump. You could wet the property well before you're evacuated. Or in other instances, you know, a backyard barbecue, something happens, and you want to put that out before a fire spreads. Are you just selling the hose? So I'm selling the hose with the adapter. You already have the pump. That pump is a standard pump in every pool? So this is standard. Our adapter is not standard. So what you do is you have your pool person install the three-way valve. It takes only about 15 minutes. So it takes some proactive. You're going to have to get your pool guy or pool girl yes. or whatever. Yes, and, and but then you leave it that way. And then right. you just like, leave it. And many people thing. already have these installed with an open port just for an outspout. So when you have those, which ends up being about 25% of my customers, you just add our adapter onto that three-way valve and you're good to go. What do you sell it for and what does it cost you to make? This 50 foot unit, I sell for $4.99. It cost me about $124 to build it. And that's right now, I'm only building about 25 to 30 units at a time. So I could definitely increase my margins. The 100 foot sells for $3.99 and it cost me about $200 to make. Educate me. So I was assuming when these fires come through that, I mean, it's just timber and a lot of things falling right onto the property. That is something that a drenched property would not solve that. But you're saying it's really the embers. So that's a huge problem, is the flying embers, because the embers fly more than a mile. They hit another roof line, they hit some dry patch of trees, they hit a bunch of trash, anything Got it. catches, and then it spreads And these again. embers so are just like, they're problem. large pieces of... Yep, just pieces of debris that are kind of flying, and they'll pick up air, and then the they fly The windier, the worse place. it is. I'm curious, um, you talked about your father, but this is his invention. Yes. So I would yeah. love to hear about you, your back and your father. This was his idea. Like I said, we were in Southern California and we every single year would have different fires occurring. And one day he looked at the pool and he said, why don't we have access? Obviously a lot of us have pools. So he started looking into it and there are some big pumps where you could buy a separate engine and drop it into the pool, but they're expensive and many people can't afford to spend thousands of dollars on something. So he came up with Firefighter when we, we were kids. Um, he passed a little bit over five years ago. So I started redeveloping it. So can the firemen use your product in some way to help them yes. to fight the fires by draining pools if they needed to? Absolutely. So the goal in the long term is that fire departments would know where every single one of these is and they could use it. And I'm really surprised Kevin O'Leary didn't ask you this. Let's, let's hear it. What are your sales? 
We just launched this February 2022. My cash flow is $22,000 in sales. And how many units is that? I've sold 49 units actually. Okay. Yeah, just under 50 units. You're just um, starting. The sales are generally small, but that doesn't mean anything, right? Well, it means they're small. No. <laughs> <laughs> Where did the sales come from? I've been partnering with pool companies because they already have the relationship with pool owners. And are you paying them a commission? Exactly, so I pay, pay them? them. So if they just sell the units themselves on a commission base, they get 20%. If I have a pool store who's buying inventory, it's 25 to 30% off wholesale, depending on how many units they buy. I love uh, the space of helping people stay safe. It, it means a lot to me, but um, I feel that this is not a place where I could add enormous value. So re regretfully I'm out, but I wish you the very best. Look, Bianca, um, not every business is investable because you're so nascent, you're so early, you're so just figuring out how to sell it. It has merit, but I just, my feeling is I could make hundreds of dollars. You can make millions of dollars, I don't and know, so I don't could know I, that. and you so have could to a couple go, you, of sharks if they wanted. You have to go prove wanted. that, so for that reason, I'm out. I think you're on the right path to success by figuring it out small. I don't know anything about this. So you see you yeah. educating me. I don't think I add value. I think a lot of people need this, but I wouldn't be able to help you, so I'm out. Thank you. Bianca, Thank you listen, in my opinion, I feel like this is the type of product that needs a lot of mouthpieces behind it. And that's and why promotion. I need. And I think this is one of these things that, Mark, if you're willing to go in yeah. with me, I think that we'll but just I, help ask, figure let, it out. Let me ask a question. Yeah, Are you absolutely. patient? I'm very patient and I'm because very hardworking. This, is, hard this yes. is a patience business, right? I know. To Lori's That's... point, some of the greatest changes, you know, entrepreneurial changes, took time. Absolutely. Right? It's going yeah. to take time for people to understand this. It's going to take time for word to get out. Right. But the good thing about this business, there's a lot of great leverage points. Yes. Because all the pool servicers all throughout California, the minute there's a wildfire and someone, you know, home is threatened, all of a sudden they understand right. it. Right. So Mark, she's asking for 150,000 for 15%. So, I mean, we're gonna have to do quite a bit of work <laughs> to, to help you here. It'll I mean, be a slow burn, literally. You're gonna need a lot I, of us, so. I understand that. So 150,000 for 25%. For 25% for yep, both of you. Us. For two both of you. Us. Don't let that hose get away. Don't let that hose get away. Would you guys do it for 20% nope. for both of you? No. No. <laughs> I can tell by your faces, you have a deal. Oh, you have a deal. <laughs> yes. No, you have a deal. I need to do it. For sure. We need to help this Oh my this gosh, world. I'm so excited. <laughs> thank you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, thank you, no, guys. Good. Congratulations. Bye, guys. Congrats. Oh, I need to start working to start getting Firefighter One to people and to start showing my dad that he did not disappoint. He didn't let us go. And, uh, we're gonna help people.